Audubon Girls Shuttle Hurdle Relay joining us down here at the uh, state track meet today. They just finished up in the preliminaries and talk with uh, Caitlin Schultes who started things off today. And Caitlin, how did you feel like you started today? Um, I felt pretty good. I mean, I could have been stronger out of the blocks, but I definitely feel like I kept my speed up through the whole thing. And so I feel like I gave it an okay start. Could have been better. Could have been worse. So. Was this one of your cleaner runs, you think, this yeah, year? Yeah, I feel like it was. I didn't clip a hurdle. I felt like I typically have trouble with my one leg swings from the inside to the outside, but I felt like I was pretty clean over the hurdles, so that was good. It felt good. Where did you feel like you were at your best? Was it early in the race, or did you have a lot left at the end? Yeah, I felt like I was best at the start because I felt like I got out hard, and I cleared the first one pretty good, and I felt like I could carry it. But then as I got to the end, I started to probably slow down a little bit just because of the adrenaline was wearing off and stuff as I was going. So. Did it help you out kind of being down here for the long jump earlier today and at least getting out here stretching and warming up some? Yeah, definitely. I feel like we've done a really good job today getting out and warming up. I mean, we've been in the field house and I've been warming up for long jump and stuff and it felt good with long jump to just have a feel of the atmosphere and stuff, so it really helped. Well, Caitlin, great job today. Thank Appreciate you, you joining Thank us. You. Let's move on now to Sydney Obermeyer who ran the second leg today. And Sid, how did it feel? I felt pretty good uh, at the beginning. At the end, I had to switch to four-step, which I don't like doing, but I feel like I switched pretty good, and then I actually went back to three-step and then finished the race, but I felt like it was pretty good. What made you switch the couple of times? Uh, I don't know. I just haven't quite gotten to that point with the full three steps, so I just thought I wasn't going to make it, so I just hurried up and switched to the four-step. Sounded and it looked like you went pretty flawless with the switch. Yeah, it felt pretty clean, and then when I went back to three-step, it was pretty clean also, so that's good. So how are you were soaking in today, and, and how are you going to use the experiences of today to maybe to help you with a high jump coming up? Yeah, the atmosphere is just really what gets me pumped up, and it's just so exciting here having so many people, and it's just awesome, and I can't wait for tomorrow to high jump. Well, Sid, appreciate you joining us. Great job today. Let's move over now to Carly Johnston. Carly, ran the third leg today. Uh, you were telling your girls you kind of forgot a little part of the race today. <laughs> Yeah, um, well, I think my nerves just kind of got to me, and I forgot to <laughs> be set up in my blocks when Sydney came. And But overall, I think that even though that I wasn't set and wasn't really quite ready, I think that it went pretty well. Did it affect you coming out of the blocks, or did you feel like you got out pretty smooth? Um, I felt like it went, I got out pretty smooth with not being set in the blocks, but yeah, I think it went all very well. Where did you feel like you were strongest, middle part, in, or right there at the um, beginning? I'm usually strongest in the beginning, but I felt like today I really was, you know, equal throughout the whole um, 100 meters. Have you soaked in some of the atmosphere today, and, and what are some of the memories you're going to take away from today? Um, Last trip down to the state track meet. I mate. know. I mean, I, I'm going to remember all of it, obviously. I mean, it's just quite a memory to keep. It's going to be pretty sad <laughs> leaving here tomorrow. Anything tomorrow you're looking forward to watching besides Sid probably jump? Um, our boys run the 4 by one that I can remember, and the, the four our girls 4 by four. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed all the girls were, you know, were, were telling you some of their yeah. events, weren't they? Well, Carly, I appreciate you joining us. Yeah. Great job. Congrats Thank getting you. down here this year. Thank you. Let's move over now to Madison Hagedorn. And Madison, uh, ran the anchor leg today. Mm -hmm. As you're watching the other, and I ask this to everybody, what kind of goes through your mind? as you're watching the first three legs of the race? Well, I'm just hoping that everyone runs clean and nobody falls <laughs> and just runs their best, yeah. What did you think as you were watching today? Clean run from what you were able to see before you went off? Yeah, I think so. I think everybody looks pretty solid. <laughs> How about you? Did you feel like you ran a good race today? Um, I feel like I was pretty strong out of the blocks in the first half, and then I got to the end and I had a four-step, two hurdles, but... It happens. What happened that made you change? Just kind of get out of rhythm a little? Yeah, and just run out of steam, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> you, did you feel like you still finished strong enough today? Yeah, I think so. Now, you guys, I think, got a season best today. Mm -hmm. uh, how's that make you feel to be able to get it down here at the state tournament? Well, that feels pretty great because we... <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> How much different is it being down here this year compared to last year making your first trips down here? 
Well, last year I was a little more nervous because it was my first time actually running down here. This year, I was still nervous, but I wasn't quite as nervous. <laughs> I tell you what, we appreciate you joining us. Great job today, and thank you very much. Thanks.